All right. Hey, it's sad fried cheesy again. So, audio drift is very, very bad in episode 15. And I was debating even posting this one at all. But I told myself that I was going to post pretty much all the gameplay that I captured for this game. So, cover your ears and enjoy the gameplay. Again, sorry about it, but I think I have it planned out to where I should only have to edit three more episodes, including this one. And then we should be clear of any audio drift issues. Yes, cross your fingers and knock on wood. Uh, yeah. Anyways, try to enjoy episode 15 of our Days Gone playthrough. Okay. Oh, also, I think I was a little hyped up when I was recording this for whatever reason, no. so yeah. I can run so much faster and farther than before. Wow, I'm so light. I'm so light on my feet. Yeah, give me that shit, Daddy. You here for your bike, right? How's the bike business going, Zanny? Yeah, Daddy, you filled me up so good. Now where am I gonna go with all my gas? Wow, that sounds so sexy. Um. Digga, digga, digga. O'Leary Mountain safe house. Okay. So I need to gather lavender and I can fast travel. Oh, yeah! I'm be like empty on fuel when I get there. Not empty, probably like less than 20%, though. I got 20%, cool. Do Mark. We got a job for you here at Peaceful Lake. Goblin. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'll head your way, St. John. Out. Oh, hate this. <laughs> Good. Ah, oh, the Rippers! Fuggin' Rippers. Hey, Deke. I'm starting to get worried. Yeah, I guess I've been gone a while. Early. Seems like it's getting light earlier. Hey, uh, you're not answering the radio. Yep. I oh, know, I was... Well, hold on, hold on. No, I'm all right, I'm all right. Just trying to get clear, you know? You're burning up. Ugh, my head's pounding like a mother. You're burning up. No, 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 I'm just, I'm just tired. Okay, stay here, rest. I'll think of something. Look, I don't need a goddamn babysitter, I'm fine. Flashback! Here, come here. I'll show you what you're looking for. <laughs> yep, found it. <laughs> All right, come on, focus. I am focused. All right, so this one is called Lavandula Angustifolia. Lavender? Yes, well, I'm still paying off my student loan, so I will stick with Latin, mm -hmm. but you can call it that. Yeah, get your money's worth. Go for it. <laughs> okay, come on, give me your hands. <sighs> All right, so you want to put one hand around the flower, All right. and then put the other hand at the stem. Okay. Just like that, and then you pull nice and slow. You know, I pulled weeds before. Uh, excuse me, sir, this is not a weed. You have to be gentle. But apply pressure. Oh, yeah, but not too hard. <laughs> okay, ready? Mm-hmm. There you go, that's perfect. <laughs> and it doesn't smell very good. Okay, you hold on to those and I'm gonna collect more. 
Oh. So, uh, why lavender? Well, the guys at the lab are pretty excited. They, they think they have this subspecies, which might have mutated monoterpenoids, which produce a modified linalool that... That is so... Oh, my... God. Thank you, Einstein. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry. It has a chemical that we can use to synthesize a new medicine for burn patients. Where I'm from, the only way you use for medicine is the kind that you smoke. You know, Boozer knows a guy with a farm that's about three miles up the road. Oh, that's great. Oh, come on, Sarah. You don't want to talk up a little bit? Prison and take you with him. <laughs> so what else do you guys make? Like chemical weapons, WMDs, shit like that? No, 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 no. Well, at least not me. Yeah? It's in my contract. None of my research can be used for military purposes. Hey, there's more over here. Wait, stop. Oh, come on, the water's yeah. gonna be great. Hold, hold on, hold on. What's wrong? Well, I, I didn't mean stop that. <laughs> come on, what is it? It's a long story. Well, that's okay. We can just walk. That's why Deacon oh. can't swim. <laughs> so, why don't you tell me about your plants? Really? Okay. Well, this particular genus is adventitious. You want me to ask? It means not native to this area. You can thank Ogden for that. <laughs> Who? Oh, shit, I asked. Peter Skeen Ogden, first explorer to come through this part of Oregon. He and some of the other early explorers brought all their medicinal herbs and plants with them. Some got away, and now they're growing here. Mostly along the shores of small lakes and ponds. First white explorer? Oh, look at you, being all politically correct. Don't buy into all the biker stereotypes you see on TV. We are actually quite charming. I bet. The MC's got a couple of brothers, one fully patched. I don't think I've seen one person of color since I arrived in your strange little backwater paradise. Yeah, Jack actually had some guys bust in from Sacramento just to piss off our skinhead rivals. He did not. <laughs> No, he did not. I'm kidding. Jersey Jim's an old buddy of mine. Patched him and myself. We served in the same unit. Come by the clubhouse Sunday. I'll show you around. You'd like the guy. He's funny as shit. He makes a mean margarita. Well, I have to be in the lab early on Monday, so... I'll have us back in your bed by 10. I promise. How can I refuse an offer like that? <sighs> okay, you try picking some now. Lavender. You, you want me to pick lavender? Yep. And bring me three plants, and don't crush them. Oh, I'm gonna crush them. <laughs> Come on. Uh, got one. Good for you. This one? Yep, keep going. Last one. Great, bring them here. <sighs> oh. <laughs> for you. Wow. Gallantry is alive and farewell after all. Well, if it's not, <laughs> then I didn't kill him. <laughs> hey! Oh, 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 oh. Aww, poor guys. Hey, is that the one we're gonna smoke later? No, but this is the one we're gonna drink. I make this killer herbal tea with it. I'll bet. <laughs> <laughs> hey! All right, if you come over, then I will make it for you as long as you can be right home. All right, great. And you're gonna be a believer. And we'll grab a beer from myself on the way over. One beer, Deke, that's it. Oh, I got two skills? I didn't even know I didn't use one.
That would be useful. that i need that and i need that oh man all right let's do range first and then next one i'm getting is this one outlines enemies that is what i need right there and then the cooldown oh i don't know if i want to do cooldown or what first but still Level 10, baby. So hold on. There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So I'm guessing there's 30, 45. Cool. I gotta restore power to that anyway. Might as well restore power to that first and then collect the lavender. Uh, sorry, uh, I'm a little out of it. What, you, you said something? It's a, uh, it's something Sarah showed me a few summers ago before. Are you anyway, kidding? Uh, there's a plant that grows out here called lavender. It grows in the shade along rivers, lake shores. I'm gonna see if I can find some. Shit, bro. The way my arm's feeling, I'll try anything, but fuck the lavender, bring something I can smoke. Whatever, I'm gonna find some of this shit, I'm gonna make a burn salve out of it, and you're gonna shut the hell up about it. Yeah, okay. I'm sorry, brother, just going stir crazy up here, you know? Uh, don't worry, booze man. Oh shit. We're riding north, I swear to God, not too much longer. You hear me? Yeah. Ow. <laughs> okay. What were you saying? Yeah. Out. <laughs> Gotta take a closer look. Got your radio on? I got bored. Figured I'd see if I remembered how to make anything. Stop by when you can. I think you'll like it. Boozer, I'm literally a couple like hundred yards I'll away. By later. If the... Uh... What is that? That looks new. A wood lily. Time. 4.40 p.m. How did it get so late, so quick? Get out of there, you zombie bitch! Probably one of the greatest lines in any zombie game ever. Or, in that game's case, a zombie mode.
Horde strategy? That means there's a horde nearby. Often the best strategy against a larger horde, especially for the unprepared, is to get good weapons and to stock up resources. Traverse the area and formulate an exit plan before attempting to take one down. Oh my god. I don't like this. Here, please. Okay, I must have taken that one down already. Are they sleeping like that? Yeah, that's pretty weird. I'll just woke up at the same time. Make sure. Oh my god. Alright. Mark a majority of the hordes so that way I know where they are. What time do they wake up? Sometime around there, I guess. this I can yep how the hell do I get in there There's not a way to get up there either. At least I don't think there's a way, but I have to before I do anything else. Oh, you know what? Jenny's out of gas. Jenny's always out of gas. Saw a gas can somewhere. Maybe there's one in here. For whatever 
prison. Sounds like that whore's getting a little closer. Where did I see that gas, man? Oh shit, whore's getting close. I probably need to go. It's not smart for me to stay around here with the power off. Alright, you know what? I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do. Because they're kind of walking towards my bike. So I guess I'll just, you know, harvest some plants. Look for some gas. Let's mark. Let's mark the bike just to see where it's at. Oh yeah, they're right on top of it. Oh, gasoline can. I said, fuck the horde. I ain't doing that right now. Going over here. Collecting lavender. I do have enough to return, but I don't want to return to my bike just yet because there's a fuck ton of zombies near them. Near it. Jeez, there's just a bunch of zombies out here in general. It's insane for real. Well, this is not good. I'm stuck in this damn tree line while all these. That horde is just hanging out near my bike. Uh. 
Are you starting to move over? Please tell me yes. What time is it? 913? Looks like they're starting to move very slowly. Alright, I'm gonna do the same. Like I said, I'm not doing the horde right now. I'm gonna come back and do this a little later. But I really wanna knock this horde out. I couldn't find the video that I, I watched earlier on how to complete it by standing on top of the train. I, I know I've. Hold up. I know I've gotten rid of all the speakers I need to. Well, I don't know for sure, but I think I have. God, man. If y'all could just, just skedaddle, that'd be great, man. I'm, I'm really trying to get me and my bike out of here and back to booze. Hey, yo. Oh, there was a... <laughs> there they go! Alright, that's perfect opportunity. I'm out of here. I'm out of here, bro. You see a bear on that mission with Lisa. I wonder if there's another bear or how often bears spawn through the game because I haven't seen too many in the wild, but I'm, I'm sure there's a reason for that. All right, let's see if we can get booze back on track. How do I repair this thing? Ah, nice. All right, booze man. Got you some lavender. My guy. Hey, boozer. Uh, God damn it. Whoa. Uh, it's a funny thing. I, I was remembering how. Uh, a few summers back, Sarah took me out to Bear Creek. We were picking lavender, and uh, she Listen. taught <laughs> she taught me how to make this sap for burns. And uh, look, I got out today. Okay, I actually had a look around the mound. I cleared some traps. The garm's almost as good as new. All right. Okay, I'm just gonna leave it right here. Hey. hey. Not what I was just expecting. Give me a couple days. Okay, just ride up north like you said, and get out of this shithole. Sure. Give me such a dick about it, bro.
Can I go talk to Boozer like this? You're shaking, Boozer. And you're asleep. You call me a pussy. up we got hit and hard rippers a couple of dozen maybe more goddamn rippers that little gal you were so worried about yeah lisa wait hold on what happened where's lisa gone they took her and three others alki followed him as far as he could but they're holed up in belknap crater he came back to round up more men but god damn it okay look i've seen what those sons of bitches do to hostages i'm not waiting Yo, there are eight hordes in this area and seven in this area jeez i still don't want to go try to kill one but i just feel like i'm still going to be in over my head i don't mean i know i need to just rip the band-aid off and do it but i'm just having too much fun doing these story missions you know I know him. Let him in. You, uh, need something, man? Wish I had a better set. You looking for something? I'll refuel you. Nice and good. Just to fix anything around here. Back to work. I can't fix this. It should work. Hey. Just looking. You got something to say about it? You got some bounties? Hey, nice. That's it for now. See you, man. That's all I got for now. Deke. Good. Got something you might be interested in. Yeah, don't bet on the cope. I'm busy. Too busy to hear about a ripper camp? Here? In the Cascade Wilderness? Rippers up here? Where? Thought you might be interested. I heard how you and Boozer got hit by him. In fact, I haven't seen Boozer around much, have I? Where, Cope? Up by Separation Meadow. Flack, you know her, don't you? Saw him firsthand. Past their camp when she was out on a supply run. Don't worry. <sighs> I'll take care of him. I like eating fish. I don't understand anyone who won't eat fish. Let him starve. Hey, something. How's it going? How you doing? Nope.
Who's man are you awake? Boozer. Yeah, Deke. I'm just feeling a little out of it, you know? Look, I'm on my way up to Separation Meadow. Cope says there's a ripper cap up there. Rippers? This far north? Yeah, Boozer. What the hell's going on with these guys? Alki said the rippers were looking for us. That we had a price on our head. What the hell? How's that possible? I mean... Sure, I've, I've killed my share of crazy bastards, but I never went out of my way. Uh, not that I remember. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, rippers. Peeking out. Should be full on ammo. Yep. Enemy camps can be found throughout the Farewell Wilderness. You have marauders, rippers, and or anarchists. I don't think I've come up with an anarchist yet. You're all filled with murderers and thieves who prey on the weak. Take them out to make nearby encampments safer. You're a zombie. Why are you up here? Well, you found me. Oh. Wanna get low? Ah, get low! <laughs> oh, yeah. Bitch. 
Here's your fucking path! Bunch of crazy assholes. What are you doing up here, huh? I'll show you. Freaking want some, bro? Oh, they got one tied up. I knew they had someone trapped. up here won't bother anyone ever again. Oh, St. John, that's good news. I talked to Manny the other day, some of the others. I know you've been doing things for the camp. I just wanted to say thank you. Mark Copeland out. Deke, you there? You find that Ripper camp? Yeah, Boozer, I found it. You think... You think they were up here looking for us? I don't know, booze man. I was too busy stopping them from cutting my eyes out to ask. Sorry, brother. I wish I'd been there. Sure, man. Yeah, I know. Deacon out. Now it's time to go over to that other mission, get that done with.
Okay. Let's take a look around. What the hell? You better get away from my bike, you son of a bitch. Not so tough now, are you? Oh shit. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to go ahead and make this the stopping point for episode 15. If you made it this far, thank you for watching. Don't forget to eat some cheese today and I will catch you in the next one. Repair the bike. <laughs>